This demonstration is going to show an SCAL upgrade comparison using just a normal fill port cable versus Web6 U-fill cable. So on the left hand side we're showing the normal fill port cable. On the right hand side is Web6 U-fill. You'll actually see the U-fill device uh, sitting there underneath the dialog box so you can see what it looks like. So we started the first phase of the upgrade which is downloading the bootloader OS, SecLive, and CoreLive to the SCAL device. So we'll go ahead and cut the video here because it does take a long time and show you what happens at the end of the first phase. So here we are at the end of the first phase. The normal fill port cable has taken three hour, a little over three hours and 30 minutes versus WebSex U fill cable has taken just a little over an hour to complete. So you see they're both completing and we're going to go ahead and start into the second phase which is downloading the UAS to the SKL. Uh, so again, what we'll do is, for the sake of time, we'll let these upgrade, and then we will come back at the conclusion of downloading the UAS to show you uh, how both of them have done. Okay, so now you see at the conclusion, you'll see the the normal fill port cable took us uh, just over six hours, about six hours and ten minutes to complete the whole upgrade to the SCAL. Versus WebSex UFIL device has taken us right at two hours, a little over two hours to complete. So you can see that it's taken about a third of the time that it would normally take in order to upgrade an SKL. Now understanding that time difference between the two, you can really understand what kind of time savings as well as cost savings that using WebSex UFIL device can really save you.